Sports on Air. Uh, we wanted it to be the most viewed and the biggest, so it's still the it's still our um, objective. Of course, we want to win it uh, and win as one. Uh, but now that's up to the athletes and to the fans to cheer them on. Sir, can you give us some positive naman? Something good that we can uh, expect from this Something well, exciting that we can the, the positive is once na a broadcast, makikita nyo world-class yung facilities. Uh, makikita nyo rin yung mga athletes natin na had almost nothing to train with. Pero uh, I really sincerely believe that many of them are going to win uh, gold medals. So, and like anything else, it's the Filipino spirit. So, to God's grace and mercy, despite lahat ng trials, pinagdaanan, uh, lahat ng kulang, ang Filipino mahanap ng paraan. And I think um, in the same way that Manny Pacquiao and uh, other world champions, uh, other Filipino world champions have uh, given pride to the country. Uh, come November 30, sa opening pa lang, and then come December 11, sa closing, uh, we'll not only be proud that we hosted Sea Games, but we'll be proud to be Filipino. Sir, regarding yung sinabi mo, regarding yung sa, sa the other analysis requesting for changes in the venues, the song? Yes, yes. Isang sport lang naman yan. Now, so, what was the sport? Uh, they'll do the announcement, yung NSA. No, but it's only um, uh, parang an additional venue. Oh. So, so, hindi siya change in venue? Um, no, they have two venues, but it's out of Metro Manila. They wanted one venue for the same sport in Metro Manila for logistical uh, and mga players na parating galing abroad. So, nasolve din naman. And on October 15, parang maraming deadlines. Like, na turn na na yung bidding ng mga Tomorrow is the board meeting of the POC. So, POC is doing a lot of the implementation. So lahat ng deadlines natin with DBM we met, but lahat ng hindi kaya ng DBM uh, will be implemented by the PSC through the POC. Congressman, you mentioned earlier na nasa crunch time na kayo. So how are you dealing with it so far? Um, it's a roller coaster ride. Uh, minsan na uh, gusto mong yakapin lahat ng tao sa sobrang sakripisyo at tulong. <laughs> minsan gusto mong sigawan yung iba na tayo-tayo na nga to, but hindi pa tayo magtulungan. Uh, no? Kasi deeply rooted ang rivalry sa sports eh, which I wasn't aware of because hindi naman ako talaga organic sa Philippine sports no but having said that it's a bigger challenge and uh, I think new friendships are being forged uh, despite nga yung uh, kayo, kayo yung nagko-cover ng sports mas alam niyo to eh di ba so sabi ko nga sa politika baka one election or two elections lang yung rivalry afterwards magkakaibigan na eh. pero sa sports parang generational yung Rivalries. But if you want to win as one, you know, it's just like in high school, barkada niya, barkada niya. But as you graduate, oh, lahat tayo pinista, lahat tayo at lasalista, lahat tayo graduate ng Bagumbayan National High School. So we have to immediately um, convert into lahat tayo Filipino, para sa Pilipinas ko, laban Pilipinas. And stop thinking that this is our side or our turf and everything. Which is happening naman. I just hope it happens uh, sooner than later. Thank you, Paul. Thank you. Thank, you. Thank you for watching. Click the subscribe button and ring the bell to be notified with our latest videos.